Welcome to the iTutorials tutorial on messaging. In this tutorial we're going to be going through the iMessage settings, how to create messages, edit and forward messages and deleting messages. The first thing that we need to do is to make sure that iMessages is actually enabled. We, we can do that by simply clicking on the settings icon on the home screen and on the left hand side just scroll down until you find settings. As you can see in my case, just there, that iMessage is turned on. I also like to have the send read receipts also on. That is entirely your own preference. Now that we have iMessage enabled, if I click on the home button to return to the home screen and click on the messages application to create an app, a message. As you can see, I already have my contact added. I simply did that by pressing the plus button and adding the contact in. You can also manually type in the contacts if you don't already have them stored as a contact. For this demonstration, I do have an iPhone, so I'm just simply going to send the word test to my iPhone just to make sure that it's actually fully working. And as you can see, the message is just going through the sending procedure, and it's just come up on my iPhone. And I will send the same word back, test. And as you can see, the message has come straight back. Also, you can see under the message that I sent from the iPad, it says red 2120, showing when the messages were read. That is an option that can be turned on in settings, as I had shown earlier in this tutorial. To forward messages or edit the message, we simply press on the arrow key in the top right-hand corner. We can simply select one of the messages by ticking it and we can either forward the message to another contact or we can simply delete a single message from the thread in this case we're going to delete the message which deletes a single message from the entire thread if you would like to completely delete the thread that can also be done by simply going to the left hand side with the messages holding down and swiping from left to right as shown and simply pressing delete and that concludes our tutorial. Thank you for choosing our tutorials. Please follow us on Facebook, Twitter and YouTube.